everyone, welcome to CGTN. We are live in Xi'an, the capital city of Shanxi province. I'm Yang Xinmeng, and here with me is a reporter from the Xi'an TV station, Song Xuanyao. Hello, Xuanyao. Hello, 大家好，我是西安广播电视台的记者宋轩瑶。欢迎大家来到西安。Exactly, and where we are right now is the Romantic Park in Xi'an City, and this is a recreation of the ancient scenery of the Tang Dynasty, the streets and everything. And Xuan Yao just told me once you walk inside the Romantic Park, it's like stepping back in history. 嗯，那我们现在所处的位置呢是千古情景区的长安广场，而大家可以看到我的身后呢就是长安门。接下来呢，我就将带着大家一起走进长安门，化身唐朝人，跟我们一起出发吧。Well, this is the Chang'an Square, and over there, that is the Chang'an Gate. You know, Chang'an is the ancient name of Xi'an. Hundreds of years ago, Xi'an was Chang'an City, and she just told me that if once you walk through the Chang'an Gate, you become、uh, the person, the 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 resident of Chang'an City. 嗯，进到这个门就可以看到很多这个大鼓。嗯哼 ，There are so many drums here. 而且今年是龙年，每一个鼓上面画的都是龙的图腾。Exactly. Look, each side, each each drum, it has a painting of dragon on it. Do we have any, you know, special saying of hitting the drum? Yeah. 鼓有没有什么？有啊，这个古代击鼓其实都代表的是一种吉祥、平安的一种祝福的寓意。所以走进长安门，所有人都要先在这里击鼓，做一个这样开始的一个寓意。Well, I really want to try it because she just said, you know,、uh, hitting the drum means blessing and good fortune. It it represents the best wishes you have. So walking through the gate, let's hit the drum first. I'll do、uh. it one more time here. Hi, dragon. Because you know, 2024 is the year of Long. We are about two weeks away from the New Year, Chinese New Year.、Uh, the grand celebration is just around the corner. And here, I feel like you know, being the capital city of 13 ancient Chinese dynasties, Xi'an has a rich history and a profound cultural atmosphere. And、uh, you can really feel the New Year vibe here. Look at the. Lanterns here, it's so beautiful. This flower is so beautiful. Yes, we in Xi'an actually have many lighted flower places. For example, our present location in the Qianggu Qing Park is one. There are also Xi'an's Cheng Qiang Park and the Da Tang Fu Long Yuan. At this time, the lights of the Qing Park are very beautiful. We also invite you to visit our Xi'an Festival in Xi'an this year. Also, Xi'an is going to you know, set up lanterns every year、uh, for the Lantern Festival, for the Spring Festival, and actually the Romantic Park is one major spot to see to watch the lanterns. And besides here, there's also you know the city wall. We we actually we also did a live streaming over there、uh, two days ago. And then, 除除了城墙，呃，千古情景区还有哪里？大唐芙蓉园。大唐芙蓉园 that's also a、uh, royal park here in Xi'an. Ah,、wow, really perfect place to you know admire the lanterns, especially during the Lantern Festival that's on January the fifteenth, Lunar Calendar. Okay, 在我的手里呢，我们今天参观的过程当中有一张任务卡。那我们今天的第一点任务呢，就是要在景区中找到诗人李白。Okay, uh, read this through for me, please. 给我们介绍一下今天所有的全部任务卡吧。嗯，第一关呢，就是我们要先找到诗人李白。稍后呢，我们要进到一个叫做中医药香囊的地方去制作一个中医的香囊。嗯，走完香囊之后呢，我们接下来要进行一项古代的投壶射击的比赛。哇、wow. ！啊，要完成投壶，最后一站呢，就是要前去学习一种舞蹈，叫做弦鼓舞。Wow, it's so exciting! So here is an assignment card she just gave me. There are four assignments today. The first one, we're going to look for a poet called Li Bai from Tang Dynasty. That's mission number one. And mission number two, we're going to make our own、uh, sachet, herb sachet. Try to make one for each of us. And mission number three is to、uh, try the pot throwing game. It's a Kind of like archery. It's a game played, you know, by ancient people. And mission number four, we're going to learn a dance. It's called drum dance. I don't know. I'm, I'm supposed to dance on a drum, but I'm so looking forward to that. So here goes mission number one. We're going to find this poet,、uh, Mr. Li Bai. He is very famous, probably the most famous poet in China. Every kid have learned his poem before. Now we start. Okay. First round, find Li Bai. Actually, this round is very simple because I have already seen that one. One look is Li Bai. Hello, hello, hello. Two ladies, good evening. Hello, Li Tai Bai. Can you sing a song with me? 
Uh, so he is really poet, Mr. Li Bai, and he's asking us to read poems along with him. Sure. Okay, so he's going to recite the first line, and we're, we'll have to, you know, follow through his lines. Okay, please listen. 床前明月光 Oh, that's an easy one. 疑是地上霜 举头望明月 低头思故乡 Oh, that's perfect. Okay, let me explain a little bit. So that poem just now was, I think it's for most people, it's the first poem they learned through their life. That's a famous poem just by uh, the poet Li Bai. Uh, translated into English, let me try here. It's um, a bed, I see the silver moonlight. Um, I thought it's moonlight along along the bed. Um, I thought it's frost, frost or ground. Looking up, I see the bright moon. Bowing in homesickness, I drowned. Oh, that's a beautiful poem here. Okay, that's a poem to describe the a deep friendship between Mr. Li Bai and Mr. Wang Lun. Wang Lun is also a poem, poet. Uh, they're really good friends, uh, Li Bai and Wang Lun. And that translated into English should be, um, no matter how deep the lake of peach blossom is, it's not as deep as the love Wang Lun has for me. That's a beautiful poem too to describe friend friendship. Okay, he's going to give us a more challenging one. Go for it. 听好了。天生我才必有用。千金散尽还复来。哎,答对了。Wow, hey, that's really a very aspiring poem. It's called um 天生我才必有用,千金散尽还复来。Heaven gave me talent for a reason. Spent now Rich will return in season. That's a beautiful one. Okay. Yeah, thank you so much. Oh, this is a thing. We got a gift. Yeah, it's a book clip. To, to put it inside, but really, it's, it, it looks like some gift uh, given us by Poet Li Bai. It's really So every mission we've accomplished will get a gift. That's, that's really fun. Can't wait for the second one. Now we're going to go to the Yan Yun Jie and Guo Yan Jie. The two paths are very interesting. We have a lot of fun and 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 fun. Yeah. All right, so mm. here are two streets. It's still under renovation, you know, for, uh, they're preparing for the grand celebration of the Spring, spring Festival, which is only two weeks away. Now we're walking through uh, this entrance gate, um, and uh, this is Yan Yun Street, mm. and on this street there are a lot of, you know, uh, a lot of different experiences we can try, a lot of food, uh, drinks we can try just to recreate the memory, the living experiences of the ancient people. Look at the construction here. It's just like an ancient street. Now I get to say why you said, you know, walking uh, inside the uh, romantic park is like stepping back in history. I feel like I'm just walking in history. Uh, 化身唐朝人啊，现在真的有那种感觉了，对，是很穿越的感觉，古色古香的建筑。嗯，而且最近有一种非常流行的打卡方式，就是换上唐装汉服来打卡长安，其实更有韵味了。尤其是大家可以看
harmonious， 就看起来很和谐。我觉得穿唐装在西安的城市里面走路一点都不违和，对，是一种沉浸式的打卡方式，嗯、现在也非常的流行、嗯。那今天呢，先来到这个街之后呢，要带大家来一起品尝一下我们这个茶、啊、茶文化在我们陕西也非常著名。OK， so let's go in and try。好，我们一起进去品尝一下。So Xin Yao just said, you know, tea culture is also very famous in Shanxi province, especially in Xi'an.、Mm. Oh, it's so warm inside. This is so warm. Yes. 而且这个茶呢叫做泾阳茯茶，这个茯茶呢跟大家理解的红茶、绿茶等等都是不一样的，它是一种制作工艺，叫做泾阳茯茶。其实呢，茯茶是，比如说我们现在市面上可以见到的所有茶，都可以利用这种茯茶的工艺变成另外一种茶。而它制作完成之后呢，就是大家可以看一下我面前的这个茶，它上面有一些金花儿。这个金花呢，是我们偶然间发现的一种制作工艺，制作完成之后，这种金花是一种菌群，可以帮助于我们的身体健康。So what? We just sit here and have a try. 我们坐下来，嗯，来看看这个，品一下这个茶。我们坐到这边。So what you are looking up there is Jingyang Fu Cha. That's the name of this tea. 呃、uh, ，so 茯茶是这个茶叶的名字，对吧？对，它是一种工艺。OK， 泾阳茯茶 is the name of this tea leaf.、Uh, it's actually a technique to make tea because you know we all say green tea, white tea, black tea. There are so many different types of tea, but 泾阳茯茶 is not a brand of tea.、Mm. It's just a making techniques to、um, process the tea leaves differently, and this is called 茯茶 And Shen Yao just showed me, you know, there are a lot of you know gold spots here. If We can take a closer look. We can give a picture. Look at these flowers. They are actually a natural process that has been found. Yes, this species has a good effect on human health. It's actually uh, uh, you know, beneficial bacteria um, through this making process, and it's actually good for your health. So I. Try it. We can smell the aroma of the tea. It's so strong. You go to the tea, I've already smelled the It feels so good, you know, in such a chilly day, chilly weather to have, you know, a cup of warm tea. 再没有什么比在这种寒冷的天气里一杯温暖的茶更舒服的了。The aroma is very strong. It's not like, you know, the green tea, the black tea we used to drink before. Um. The scent is very unique. It has a very unique smell, and this smell is very strong. It has a very strong smell. Yes, you can smell the smell from the window. And the way we drink tea is in such a cold way. You can smell the smell from the window. 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 To here and just you know tangerines,、um, peanuts, just everything.、And、there are over some some dates、mm. there and some fruits. Yeah,、uh, to chat through the tea time is very popular.、Uh, a way to to relax. And actually, you can see the color of this tea is pretty dark. So it also can be translated to Jingyang dark tea. Jingyang is a place, right? 对，是泾阳是地名。Jingyang is the name of a, 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 of a place. So this this tea is produced in、uh, Jingyang. That is why it's called Jingyang Dark Tea. 嗯，它也被叫做陕西的官茶。官茶是官方的官茶。对，其实是可以这么理解的。Ah, so it's also known as the official tea of Shanxi Province. It's like a、uh, can I say it this way? It's like a name card of Shanxi Province. 可以说算是陕西的一个名片了。对，非常著名的一种茶。而且呢，我们很多人应该看过一部电视剧，叫《那年花开月正圆》，它讲的其实里面就会有关于这个茶的故事。而且呢，泾阳的就是这部电视剧的背景的地方。OK， so 那年花开月正圆 ，I've heard of that。嗯，我听说过这个这个电视剧啊。So there is a very famous TV series in China. It's called 那年花开月正圆。Let me let me see if I can translate it into English. Um, when the moon is round. 
and one of Flower Blossoms, that's the name of the TV series. It's very famous, very popular. It was just filmed in Jingyang City, um, and it actually tells the story of the tea. It's a really, really, you know, loved TV series by Chinese audience. 是的，是的。好，那我们在冬天品完这个美味的茶之后，继续就要打卡下一个任务了。出发吧。Okay. We're in a hurry, so I think it's enough for for us, you know, to warm up. Now, let's go for our mission two, three, and four. 好，出发，出发，下一站任务。Next stop. Um, let me see. Mission number two is going to make a herb sachet. 香囊，我们要去做一个香囊，找一个地方。而且这个香囊不一样的地方在于，它是中医要做这个香囊。Oh, so it's not just herb sachet. 不只是这个呃、uh, 草药的香囊，还是中医药。It's actually not just any ordinary common herb. It's specially made by Chinese medicine. It's Chinese medicine herb sachet. That's a bit difficult to find, and there are so many different types of, you know, merchandises, vendors here. 有很多不同的小店啊。对，其实每一家小店都有当地的特色。And you see, it's how so interesting that you know the vendors themselves they're wearing you know traditional costumes. 他们这个小商贩本身就穿着这个很不文革的古代的服装。是，就是沉浸式的体验。啊， this is really a place where you can immerse yourself into the culture, into the history. 好，接下来前面就到了我们中医药香囊的打卡点了，到了第二个任务点。Wow, such good eyesight. All right, so look here, take a look here. 中药草香囊 This is like the slogan, uh, the brand of each store. This is also very, very traditional because you know in ancient times on the streets. There's no such, you know, brand logos during the old times. They have the use flag like this to write on their, you know, names of the stores. This is Zhongyao Cao Xiangnang traditional Chinese herb sachet. Let's see. Oh, this is actually how they make it. So this is how they grind. They they grind、uh, the herbs into powders to put it into the sachet. Wow. This is so cool. So. So many kinds of it. 您好，您好，我看到桌面摆了很多种不同的这个，呃，这应该算中药材。因为中医药草香囊的不同之处在于它是有不同的功效的。是的。就像我们墙上展示的每一种，它其实都有不一样的作用的，比如说提神解困呀、防蚊虫等等。All right. So over there is actually the ingredients of、uh, different herb sachet. So with different ingredients, you use the traditional medicine here, and it will have different effects. It will help will help with your、uh, health. You know, some of them I I I am looking at the third one, Fang Wen Chong Xiang Nan. That's you know to prevent、uh, the insects, the mosquitoes, the flies. Um, there are just different uses. That we are going to do, right? Yes, we are going to try to make two herbs. We can first choose the herbs. Let's see if we like the herbs. Alright, so that's the sachet. Now we are going to take one and put it in the sachet. Now we are going to take one and put it in the sachet. Now we are going to take one and put it in the sachet. Now we are going to take one and put it in the sachet. Now we are going to take one and put it in the sachet. Now we are going to take You can you know you can write on your comments which one which one you like which one you would choose. That's a good one. 对，我选择了红色嘛，过年了。Traditional color, yeah,、mm. for spring festival. But I'm going to pick.、Uh, you see, on here there's actually auspicious lines. 高升多金 This one is wish for you know.、Uh, Money, more money. This one wish for fortune, and the red one, red is the auspicious color here. I will take. 很难选择，是吗？都很漂亮。It's really a hard choice because everyone is so every yeah everyone is so beautiful. I'll pick with this one. I like blue. OK， 我们俩都选择好了。Yeah, I'll take this one. 嗯，其实香包是一种国家级的非物质文化遗产，大家可以看到我身后就有这个牌匾，它上面就介绍了庆阳香包的绣制这种国家级的非物质文化遗产， okay, 还有这个手工药香的制作技艺。Right over here, this is national intangible cultural heritage, the technique of making uh herb sachet. This is 庆阳香包的绣制 ，the herb sachet in 庆阳。Oh, we're going to try to learn how to make a national intangible cultural heritage. That's so fun. You 坐下来。好。
，先请老师给我们介绍一下，对，介绍一下这个怎么制作，有什么样的流程呢？你要做什么想法？做哪种？二十个选择一下，是吗？对，这边有六种东西，很需要哪一种？ Uh, so let me translate a little bit. So first, we are going to pick one uh, among the six different ingredients. The first one is good for kids, for children, for their health. And the second one is for good sleep. If you don't sleep well, you can use that one because that one has lavender inside it. And third one I've mentioned before is to prevent insects, uh, mosquito bites, flies, bad. Uh, and the fourth one is, you know, to make you more I would say sober. You you won't get tired so easily. And the the fifth one is for your nasal. Uh, if you your nose don't feel well, you can choose the fifth one. And the sixth one is just uh, you know, uh, it's more fragrant. It smells better, I guess. So I'll pick the sixth one. Well, I'll choose the sixth one. 那我选第四个吧，提神解困香料。Okay, and she is going to make the fourth one to make you feel better, less tired. Uh, more sober. The sixth one I'm looking here at uh, the ingredients includes asmanthus flower, rose flower, and just everything that smells good. I would love someone that smells really good. Okay, 那老师来给我们说一下这个怎么制作呢？呃，它是每一个功效里面有十几种草药，一瓶一瓶。那您来给我们说一下我们选择的第四个和第六个怎么制作？第四个它是提神解困的，嗯，它把所有的配料配在这个罐子里，然后打、啊，要不然放这个碾子里，啊，这两个都可以选择，都可以吧 ？OK， so。The, uh, the ingredients over there is just a list of them. They're just listed three or four different ingredients, but actually uh, the total, the entire ingredients uh, uh, conclude you know, more than 10 different stuff here. And then you can choose to put all the ingredients here to smash them or over there to grind them just into little pieces or even powder. Just to make them into little pieces or even powder. Oh, they have to be little pieces. Yes, don't be too little. Okay. To make it into small chunks uh, or powder, but not too you know, tiny. Otherwise, you know, the aroma won't last very long. Let's start. We want to choose that. 你要选这个，对，来感受一下。我给你先配啊。好，老师会先帮忙配好。OK OK， so OK， so the master here is going to 这个是什么？丁香，丁香，这是那个第六个是吧？对，这个是个香朱子。So now she is picking different ingredients here. 这个是花，这个花的最后放。Here， into this， 安息香。Into this container so that I can kind of grind them. Okay. 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 Add them in the last step because asmanthus flower is already, you know, in small chunks. It's very easy to grind it, but this one is bigger. It's not so easy to grind them into powder, so we'll have to do this first. It will take about two minutes. To do this, I will make it faster. No, I'm pushing it really strong. Okay, because she said, you know, don't make it too small. Ah. Oh, that's rose. This is this is a rose. Rose. So there's jasmine, there's rose, and there's asmanthus. Ooh, it will smell. Perfect. Oh, perfect. I love flowers. So, well, I'm making this. How about you start on your, uh, your sachet? You now, yeah, we, we two at the same time. Okay. No problem. You now, you now, do. That, teacher, my this can help me pair. Yeah. I'm. I'm the fourth. Calm down. 迷迭香，对，这个是甘草，来。
我觉得这个配药的过程也非常的解压，是呢，很有趣。好了，我也需要过来倒它，是吧 ？Yeah, the process of adding、oh, these ingredients is actually very, you know, stress relief. 哎，我脑心，其实行，脑心脑不跳的。我觉得看起来还挺好玩的。是呢 ，It looks really fun. I think mine is okay now. 这么多东西。现在也可以倒啊、哦！现在倒这个倒其实大概也是，哇，这个好重啊，这个非常的重。<笑>我帮你拿着，你来。啊、哦。其实这个也是一项体力活。It's your workout for today. Ah, oh. yours. The aroma is so strong. 这个闻起来好好重啊！提神，对，提神，上头的那种。Yeah, once you smell it, I'm not tired anymore. If you feel sleepy, 然后再再找一下。If you feel sleepy, you have to, you know, sniff your sachet. This one. 这个是这个这个味道真的很提神，很提神。I can smell the fragrance of her medicine, her herbs. 好了好了好了，啊，我装。我们我们来试一下怎么装吧。I feel like you're. I I can smell the uh smell of mint. 是有一点薄荷在里面的，对不对？对，有薄荷。嗯、然后怎么装呢？好，我来看一下，帮我拿一下。这个大概能留香多长时间？呃，留香一年，因为都是对都是现场制作的，留香时间比较久。哇，这 room can last for as long as a year。然后拉住吗？对，对一拨，拿过一把。好，谢谢。来，来，我来装我的。I'm now making. I'm now making my own little sachet. Oh, your is really very good. You just brought it in, so it's very strong. Oh, the sachet smells really nice. Let me try mine. Okay, so the sachet is really nice. Let me try mine. Ah, mine is good as well. I don't want to say mine is better, but mine is better. It just, you know, uh, the sense of different flowers mixed together. Just imagine how good it can be, how good it smells. I added, you know, jasmine, roses, asmensis. All these flowers, they have really, you know, they're very fragrant. The fragrant smell. Just the flower themselves. Let alone, I've already grant them into, you know, uh, powder. So the fragrance is even stronger. Yeah. 老师，您取这个量，我觉得刚刚好哎。对，老师配比的非常好。对。很漂亮，我们可以这个香包就可以随身携带，挂在身上或者挂在卧室里。其实，在古代的时候，不管男女，他们都会随身带香包。而且好像也是一种定情信物，是的呢，可以男女之间互赠香包。对。
so in the old times, they actually, no matter female or male, they will have these、uh, herbs sachet along them all the time. They just put it, put them in their pockets or tie them on the belt.、Um, Everyone has a herb sachet with them, and actually, it can be used as a something you know to show your love. Like,、um, say I'm a girl, and if Xuan Yao was、yeah. a boy,、um, I can you know make a sachet by myself and give it to Xuan Yao. It means I have feelings for him. 就是如果我手工做了一个香包，我给你的话，其实就是代表了一种感情的传递，对，是一种情谊之间互赠礼物，是一个很好的素材，是一个非常漂亮的东西。哇，好漂亮！嗯，那我们也算是完成了两个漂亮的香囊。嗯、Beautiful, I like it。是的，而且、no, 味道非常好闻。Nice. Oh, I love this one. Thank you， 谢谢您，谢谢您。那完成任务是不是也会有那个？我们是不是有礼物呀？对，会不会有小礼物？好 ，She's going to give us a gift. Oh, oh, wow. Oh, this is beautiful. This is a bracelet. 一个手镯。Take a look. 是一个古风古色的，其实有点像唐代的那种首饰。这感觉像是朱砂哦。对，对，是朱砂的。对，朱砂的。哇、wow. 哦，辟邪。还有辟邪的作用。It also represents,、uh, you know, uh, blessings, uh, for people. It's so beautiful. 谢谢您，谢谢您，谢谢您。And it's in red. You know, everything in red is perfect for、uh, spring festival celebration. 在在春节的时候，身上带点红色的，其实是一种习俗，一种传统。对，还有我们刚刚制作的这个香包也是一种红色的，的很漂亮。嗯，那完成了第二个礼物，嗯、也是拿是完成第二个任务。那接下来的下一个任务就是一个有点考验自己的体力啊，还有这个准头的一个项目，叫做投壶，应该也是有这个打卡任务的。我不知道是不是很难呢？我们去感受一下吧。嗯，哦，有人在。嗯，您好。您好。啊，咱们这儿是不是有投壶的体验呀？是的，欢迎两位来体验我们的投壶游戏。我们的任务呢，就是十只进三只，便可以通关成功。啊，十个要进三个，我可以先来试一个吗 ？It's a little bit challenging. So this is mission number three, ah,、uh, pot throwing. It's actually、uh, an ancient game. You know, the ancient people used to play this. You know, especially in royal family,、uh, when they entertain guests, because you know people have you know special techniques for about archery. In the old times, they go hunting, right? But when they entertain guests, what if your guests they don't know anything about archery? So they put it in this way. It's actually a combination of your coordinates of your different of your body,、uh, and also you have to calm down your mind. It's a perfect way to just balance your mind and your, your mental and physical health. Uh, she, you can try. You, 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 Not a cheat. 加油 ！All right. 我刚刚说啊，我们这个刚明明是明明是，哎，测验一下，实验一下，信了就算是真的了。嗯。我们都被 nervous。可以说近一点点。OK。往前够。哦、oh.。结束 test， 这还能当实验吗？实验结束了。<笑>好。然后一人五只，对吧？好的。好 so each of us five for each. You first. Go、okay. ahead. Yeah. <laughs> You're so good at it. <laughs> 该你了。可以稍微近一点点，然后往前伸。Okay. Stand closer. Yeah. That's easy. I、oh. think we already won. I think we, you know, it's. Is it cheating? It's too easy. We shouldn't stand this close. You should not be this close. Okay. 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 Okay.
Yeah. Ah, we found the way. Nope. Wow, yeah. wow you're so good. Oh, cool. cool. So how many oh, in total? Eight. Oh, five. Eight out of ten. Oh okay. my god, I didn't expect that. Okay, yeah. Wow. Uh, uh -huh. Oh, oh my god. Thank you. This is actually a hair decoration. You know, when you when you tie your hair in old times, so matter you're male or your or, or, or female, just put it in uh, your hair to tie it up. This is beautiful, very uh, I like how it looks so traditional. Wow,好好看。你看到面前其实有很多大家祝福的一些牌子,比如说上面都会写着大家对新一年的美好愿望。啊,比如这儿。年年有雪,雪吹年年,2023一切顺利,这是之前许下的。Yeah, that yeah, that's from last year. Wish everything smooth and happy in the year of 2023. Now we are about to celebrate the year of 2024. It's really a good way to write down your wishes. You know, I don't know if you can hear it right now, but just standing here under the shelf, you can hear, you know, the wind going through and each of this little wood board click each other. It's very soothing, just the sound of it. This yeah. So, exactly. So, what your New Year wishes? What do you wish for in the year of 2024? Write down in the comments. Let us know your wishes, and just wish everything can go as smooth as it can be. Yep,我们已经完成了第三个任务,叫做宋城塔。然后下面有一个这样的演出,这个舞蹈叫做胡玄舞,现在面前就是我们的胡玄舞的演员。Wow, so this is drum dance. Oh,非常漂亮。That's so elegant. So the drum dance is literally dancing on a drum. That's a giant drum she is standing on. And is that her sleeve? The long silk she's waving. It's so elegant. Wow. Oh, very beautiful, very beautiful. Wow, so elegant. Just really recreating the dancers and the old times. I think this is some performance that you can only see in the royal family. 感觉只有在皇室里面才能看到这么美的那块的舞蹈。它叫玄谷舞,就是因为在这个鼓上舞蹈。那我们也请老师来到我们的旁边。那我们最后一项任务,刚刚任务卡上面写的是我们要跟着
，哇，再高一点，再再高一点，五六七，走，走。That's so beautiful. And the last one is just rotating. Wow, you look like a fairy. You know, you 这样看起来真的有有那种仙女的感觉了。Oh, I want to try. 谢谢老师。那下一个老师。Wow, I feel a little bit stressed. 你都给我压力了，你跳的这么好。哦、oh, ，我觉得其实不是很难的。真的吗？不难不难。Okay, so there's actually there there's a stick and net to. 好，第一个动作。第一个动作。Give you extra support. 啊、uh, okay, ，我要先把它弄开。上下。All right. 左右交错。对对对，非常棒，非常棒。You can look from the side. Oh, this is not as hard as it looked. Okay. 然后第二个是，先蹲下，然后往上抛上去，波浪下来。哦、oh, ，OK。So he just said, 欲下，欲上先下。Right. So if you want to wave it to the up, we need to bind down a little bit first. 是这样吗？再高一点，再力气再大一点。对对对,对。哦，它是需要力气。对的，对的，对的。非常棒。对，因为这个绳子呢，它非常的沉，其实。对。这个 soap, you know, the soap is so long. It's actually. Pretty heavy, so it takes a little bit of strength to lift it up. Wow. 第三个动作。第三个动作，两只手打开，然后这样圈就,就好了。对。啊、oh, ，这是真的，真的非常漂亮，像仙女一样。还要留头。<笑> All right, I'm feeling a little bit dizzy now. 好嘛。怎么样？怎么样？好玩吗？好玩。老师是真的仙女哦。好，我们完成了最后一个挑战。哦、oh, ，Thank you。我发现我们是获得了一个，就是古代人日常用到的一些物件的集合。Oh, so this is a earring.、嗯、this is a pair of earrings. So beautiful.、嗯、also has something red in it. So actually, we earned a little bit of、uh, 嗯、just daily the daily necessities that ancient people would use. This is your、yeah. sachet, and we have the herb sachet, the earring here, the bookmark here. And also the hairpin. Oh, and here as well. 对，拿到了很多。The bracelet. 是的，那今天我们感受了一下唐代的一些文化，还有一些礼仪之后呢，最后我们接下来将会带大家一起来品尝我们西安的美食，因为我们西安也是一个美食之都，很多人呢都会特意来打卡我们西安的小吃。接下来就一起出发去吃好吃的吧。So we are going to try some local cuisines. Ah, you know, Xi'an is also very famous for its food here. Wow, my mouth is actually watering right now. Now let's go、yeah. to have some food. Chupa. Hello, hello. Welcome back. Well, after touring around the Romantic Park and experiencing so many different activities, I really am a little bit hungry now. Thank you so much, Xuan Yao, for for the lunch here, and it's so good to see Anna here. Hi, Anna. Hi, nice to see you again. Well, probably a lot of audience is not so familiar with Anna. We did another live stream、yeah. uh, just a few days earlier, I think three days earlier. Yeah.、Uh, touring days. around the city wall in、yeah, Xi'an.、Yeah, really、yeah, it's really fun. So, how do you? In, how about you introduce yourself to our audience? Hey, hello everyone. My name is Anna. I come from Romania, and I'm a PhD student in Xi'an Jiao Tong University. Yes,、uh, Anna is actually a new resident、uh, in Xi'an. She、yeah. has been staying here for. Mm, half a year, yeah, right, right? six months. Yeah, yeah. So good to see you again. Yeah, nice to see you. So I just saw, I just watched your live stream. Oh, you did? Yeah, you went to the romantic park, right? Yes, yes, yes. Ah,、uh, so I saw you were dancing there. Oh yeah, yeah. We did try the dancing、yeah. there. Ah,、mm-hmm. uh, 那个那个丝绸舞啊，对，我玩那个。对，对 it's it's not as hard as it looks, but it's so fun. I think it's a really unique experience.、Right? Mm-hmm. Yes, it is. So, are you hungry? I am, you know, right now sitting here, smelling the aroma of the delicacies here.、Mm-hmm. Thank you so much, Xuan Yao. Okay, we just played a little bit of fun with the language. Next, we'll take you to see the beautiful and delicious food. Now, we're here at the Xi'an Fan Zhuang. Here, there's a hundred years of history. So, here, the food is very strong. Today, we're going to have a little bit of fun with the language. Next, we'll take you to see the beautiful and delicious food. Now, we're here at the Xi'an Fan Zhuang. Here, there's a hundred years of history. So, today, we're going to have a little bit of fun with the language. Next, we'll take you to see the beautiful and delicious food. Now, we're here at the Xi'an Fan Zhuang. Here, there's a hundred years of history. So, today, we're going to have a little bit of fun with the language. Next, we'll take you to see the beautiful and delicious food. Now, we're here at the Xi'an Fan Zhuang. Here, there's a hundred years of history. So, today, we're going to have a little bit of fun with the language. Next, we'll take you to see the beautiful and delicious food. Now, we're here at the
。OK， 那先来看我们面前的这道吧。Uh-huh. 这道菜呢非常的著名，它叫做长安葫芦鸡。那这个葫芦鸡呢，其实它的做法也是非常讲究的。首先，它是从唐玄宗时代传到现在来的，而且呢，它的这个外形长得像什么？像葫芦。所以这道菜叫做长安葫芦鸡。Wow, so. Right here, I think you you introduce this one first because this is the most important one, right? This is the most important, the most important. It's called Chang'an First Wei. Oh, Chang'an First Wei. Yes, the first major、um, taste. Wow. The ma- first flavor of Chang'an of Xi'an. Yes, this is called Hulu Ji Gorge Chicken. Uh, actually, um, the name is because of the shape. You know,、mm. it looks like a gourd here. Actually, the plate also looks like the gourd. Should be.、Mm, wow. This it it also has a long history. Can originate to Tang Dynasty. 在唐玄宗的时期啊、哦，传到现在的，所以也是我们西安招待外宾非常重要的一道美味。Wow. Let's、okay. just not talk. Oh, we can try. Okay. 好。它的制作方式也很特别啊，比如说大家看到它的是一整只鸡来烹饪的方式。嗯、最早的时候，它先需要去拿水煮，哦、煮熟之后呢，放到笼屉里面去蒸，蒸好之后，最后再油炸。所以它看到的外皮是非常酥脆的，是金黄色的。Can you hear this sound? Like this yeah, I, I do. I, I don't know if the audience can also hear that. It's very crispy, right? Hmm. Wow. Just the skin is very crispy. Oh, my mouth is watering right now. So, <laughs>、uh, yeah, Xuan Yao just said, you know, the cooking technique is actually very different, very unique for this gourd chicken. Ooh, that's a big chunk. 是的，它的外皮是这种酥脆的外皮， yeah. 但它里面的肉非常的嫩， mm-hmm. 而且呢，因为它外皮是一整个的，所以还有一种说法叫做一块脱骨，就是把一只筷子插进去，它整个可以把这个骨头剥离。Oh, you didn't tell me that. Oh, oh、uh, let, let's first let's let's first uh tell our audience. So, uh, the cooking technique, you need to boil the uh chicken entirely in water first, and then the second step is to steam it. After steaming, you need to fry it in the oil. 第三步就把它去炸。是的。Uh, mm. And then because it's very crispy, there's a saying like 一块脱骨 means if you stick in one chopstick, yeah, it, the the uh the meat and skin will just tear off from the bone. 你帮我们演示一下吧。嗯，其实它就是把筷子插进去之后，因为它外皮是一整个，嗯，所以插进去之后可以直接把它的骨头掀起来。啊，我们使劲一下就可以，因为它比较大，这个鸡。OK， that's pretty big one。哦，拿这边压一下。OK， 我们来试一下。哦，我往上哈、哦。好。可以把它掀开，直接可以看到里面的肉质。哇。Is this for real？ 对，它里面的肉非常的鲜嫩。哦，哇。OK， 我们来品尝一下吧。Yeah。We should do this first. Yeah. I really didn't know. Actually, I tried this dish before. Oh, you do? Yeah. How do you like it? It's one of my favorite food in Xi'an.、Yeah. Oh, let me try. I also want to try this one. Let's see. It is the same. Mmm, very、mm. good. Wow, it's so good. Um,、mm. um, you know, just sitting here, first I could only smell the、uh, aroma of the chicken, but now、mm. tasting that, the skin and the meat. The skin is very crispy. It's deep fried, but it's not greasy. It's not oily, and the meat inside it is tender. That's a perfect combination. It's tender. It's juicy, not dry at all. Wow,、mm, I love it. 非常香。那接下来我们再看面前还有一道菜。Mm. 这个菜呢是一道牛肉。啊，但你可以看到它外表看起来颜色非常的丰富，而且它里面有不同的椒类，有花椒，有各种红色的椒、青椒等等，有很多种椒放在一起。然后它的口味也是酥麻，还带点辣的味道。我们可以来品尝一下。Mm-hmm. This looks very spicy, right? Yeah. Do you eat spicy? Yeah, I can eat spicy. Since、mm-hmm. I came to Xi'an, actually before I didn't like spicy. Oh really? Now Xi'an is a famous, you know, city famous for its. Renowned food here, so、yeah. okay. have a try. try. This is、um, beef. It looks really spicy.、Mm. There are different、um, peppers in it, so we can、mm. see the red chili pepper, and then there's a lot of you know the small peppers here to add the flavor of it. I'll try. I really like、um, the spice Xi'an used in their cuisine.、Mm. 
It's very really nice. Actually, it's it not smells very smells so bad. It smells so good. Mm. It smells like you know, a little bit like Sichuan food. 有点像川菜的那种，对，这个吃起来也是麻麻辣辣的，其实也是有陕西的做法融入进去的。嗯。What What's the name of this dish? 这道菜其实也是我们陕西的牛肉的一种做法。除了这个之外呢，还有一种菜叫做陕西酱牛肉，也是我们陕西的一种牛肉的做法。嗯，我相信大家看过我们中国的古代的这些武侠片。然后那些侠客去餐馆吃饭，他第一反应就是会说、嗯、啊，来两斤牛肉，再来两壶好酒，对不对？ Exactly. 啊，就是这种牛肉传承到了现在，嗯、演变成了我们现在的酱牛肉。Yeah, and I'm not familiar with that. You know, in a lot of、uh, TV series talking about ancient Chinese、uh, culture,、um, when you know the soldiers were,、uh, they walk into a restaurant, the first thing they would ask. Is wine and sauce beef. This is a sauce beef. Try it. This is one of my favorite here. 嗯，然后这个牛肉它比较特别的地方在于，它是拿一种很浓厚的一种酱料煮出来的。它把这个牛肉煮熟之后放凉，然后切片儿，变成我们现在看到的样子。And you have to dip it into the chili sauce here. 要蘸一点辣油。对，它在旁边用这个料辅佐，辅佐就会味道层次很。层次感会更香一点。It's a little bit sour. I think the chili oil also has vinegar in it. 这个辣油里面还有点醋，是不是？对，是酸辣酸辣的味道。Adding up to the flavor, and also that beef dish I was tasting. You know, when I smell it, it、uh, tastes like it smells like you know Sichuan food, but not as spicy, because you know Sichuan food is famous for its you know the spice, very spicy, very hot. But what that one? It smells very aromatic, but when it tastes not as you know as strong as the Sichuan food, it's more like、um, traditional. It's more you know、um, mild than、yeah. the Sichuan food. 我觉得那个菜就相比于川菜嘛，就刚刚呃我闻起来的时候麻麻辣辣，很像那种川菜的牛肉的做法，但是吃起来没有那么川菜那么。呃，那么辣，直辣，那么火爆，更有一点点含蓄，对，就像我们陕西西安的种性格一样，对，比较含蓄的性格，更口感是更丰富的一种。是，而且你尝到这个牛肉，会不会发现它的肉，这个肉质非常的鲜嫩，嗯，而且很紧实，是因为它每一片上面都有筋，它是挑选了上好的牛肉制作出来的，哦、所以你可以品尝到它食材本身的鲜味 OK， I'll show our audience a new slice。嗯。Here, okay, okay, we can we can, uh, have a close up here. We if we can take a close up, then you can see that every piece has a tiny bit of color. That's why you know the texture of the beef is very solid,、yeah. but it's not hard at all. At all, it's very soft, but it's not hard. 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 它这个肉要煮很久很久，慢慢的去让它那个浓汤入味儿、嗯，然后才会出来这样的比较好的。Oh, not that long. <笑>几个小时。Yeah, because they will have you know the beef broth, uh, to cook it, to uh cook it in you know like a slow stew, uh cook it in the beef broth, uh that is a traditional um ingredient, um to cook this beef, and then after that make it into very thin slices. You can just take a look how thin the slices are. 它每一片都很薄，而且非常的均匀 ，evenly cut into slices。啊 ，OK， 那我们来介绍下一道菜吧，往左边坐一点、嗯。好，我们看到面前的这道，这道呢叫做手抓羊排、嗯。哦，上面的肉是羊肉，底下有一些米饭。嗯哼，它是两种混合在一起，嗯、大家可以先尝一下它的口感。No, I really, I like this plate. I love the this container. Plate. Yeah, the the. <laughs> The lamb here, the the meat here is holding the lamb here. So this is the lamb rib. It has lamb rib on top, and beneath it is rice. But the rice is also different. Is this fried? Hmm. I don't think it's fried. I think it's uh like more like rice stew. Oh.、Okay. Look like steamed and also cooked, boiled in some broth here. 
呃，这个这个米饭看起来也很特别啊，它不像是炒饭，像是用这种高汤是吗？是它它这个呃米饭上面是沾了很多这个羊肉的酱料的，哦、所以它上面颗颗发着光，因为它上面有这个料的香味。对，所以 every every rice here is like shiny with the oil. It's it's just completely inside oil. So uh, the rice here is mixed with you know. Um, the ingredients of the lamb rib. 而且呢，这个羊肉它的最特别的地方在于它的食材。嗯、mm-hmm. ，这个食材呢是我们的陕西衡山的羊肉，被称作羊肉中的，被称作肉中的人参。嗯、mm-hmm. ，所以它本身食材是非常非常鲜美的。嗯、mm-hmm. ，而且它的制作呢，也是为了保持肉的口感，它经过一个小时的文火慢炖慢煮。然后做出来之后呢，再加盐，这样就不会影响它的肉质啊，也可以保持它的口感。煮的时候是先不加其他佐料的，不加佐料，慢慢先把它煮熟之后，嗯、最后再下盐。You know why the lamb tastes so good is because you know the meat itself. Um,、嗯、the uh, they 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 only choose you know sheep from 陕是陕西哪里的？衡山，陕西衡山。That is a place. Uh, the lamb there is called um 山羊。羊肉，羊呃，就是是陕西衡山的羊是什么说法？它其实是因为它的这个养殖的环境，嗯、然后呢，让它的肉质非常的鲜美，有嚼劲，嗯、脂肪的含量也比较低。啊、uh, ，also because of the environment there in 陕西衡山 ，the it's not so fat， 呃、uh, ，就是 the meat is not as greasy as you know ordinary meat， 呃、uh, 嗯、，the lamb here， 呃、um, ，and also it is cooked， 呃、uh, ，in you know slow stew， 呃、uh, ，for one hour。Uh, without any ingredients, just the meat itself. And after one hour,、uh, they will add some salt onto it just to、uh, best preserve its flavor. Hmm. Oh, that's so nice. 尝起来怎么样？你感觉 ？Very nice. 你觉得尝着和其他地方的羊肉有什么区别吗？会不一样吗？嗯，这个更嫩，更嫩一些。Yeah. 对对。因为它的制作方式，包括它的食材原料，都是用一种非常精心的制作，所以你会在品尝它的过程当中感受到它食材本来的那个鲜美。嗯、mm, ，It's very tender because usually the lamb rib, um,、mm, is a little bit greasy. I'm not an ordinary fan of lamb rib, although I I really love to eat lamb, but lamb rib is a little bit too fat for me. But this one is just perfect. And actually, I think it's quite hard to cook it. Yes,、yeah. yes, it takes one hour. Yeah, yeah. As for me, because I don't have too much experience, I think it's really hard to make this. Well, that's、dish. that's a challenging, you know, dish、yeah. to cook, not for、yeah. beginners. Yeah, for sure. 是的，而且每一道美味就好像在用厨师和这个食材在和你有一种交流的方式。Uh, 对 ，Yeah, that that's a beautiful saying. Um, she was saying that you know. Every dish here in Shanxi in Xi'an is like a talk between the chef and the customer. It's like chef is using、uh, these dishes as a mid as a media to convey to to you know transfer a message to us.、Mm-hmm. I really can feel you know their 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 seriousness in in cooking in 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 the food here. 口感也很棒，大家可以尝一下那个米饭。它的这个饭呢，也不只是普通的白米饭。也是有这个肉的香味在里面。Okay. Hmm. Not just ordinary rice. Uh, smells like you know lamb gravy. Hmm. For me, it tastes a bit like fried rice, but it's、oh, not really fried. Yeah.、Mm-hmm. I don't think it's too fried,、mm. but definitely it has the flavor of the lamb yeah, into it.、Sure. Nice. Adding up to the flavor, perfectly. Okay, next one. 好，我们现在看到的这道菜呢叫做双海烩。嗯，刚刚有讲到陕西人他的性格其实是含蓄的。嗯，但是陕西人的实诚会体现在一些行动上面。嗯，比如说大家看到的面前的这道菜，在我们陕西的渭南有一种席面叫做九碗十三花。那双海烩就是其中的一道菜，而这道菜呢，其实是里面的重头戏，就是非常非常珍贵的。因为在最早的时候，物资比较匮乏的时候，像这道菜的话，它里面用的海参和鱿鱼是非常珍贵的，也是我们陕西人待客的一种呃重视的一种表现啊。Uh, 
So this one is called double seafood stew. It has two different、uh, types of seafood in it. It has the、uh, squid and also、uh, the sea cucumber here. Um, because you know Shanxi is in central China, it's not a ocean, you know, seaside、yeah. city.、Uh, but this is how they entertain their guests. They show their guests everything they have、um, to just to you know create a best experience for them. Okay, let's try it. Let's try it. Let's try it. So I just understood that this was this originated from Weinan, right? It's also a city from yeah, Shanxi. Yeah, yeah. I think. I think I'm taking a bamboo shoot here. This should be a shoot. Yes. But its main food is fish. Yeah, that also depends. Fish and fish. Uh huh. I'll take um a slice of the squid. This one should be. And its sauce is very similar. The main flavor of its food is derived from its sauce. Yeah. I really can tell, you know, in Shanxi Province, especially in Xi'an, um, the uh, color of the dishes are pretty dominant. Yeah. 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 Ye
它因为它整个是圆圆滚滚的样子，然后上面刺、okay. 这个伸出来的刺，像不像松鼠背后毛毛是吗？对对，那个毛毛，然后圆圆的。Uh, because not just as ordinary fish, this one is. If you look from the top, it's in a round shape,、mm -hmm. and with these, you know, meat pointing to different angles, just like you know, the fur on the squirrel.、Mm -hmm. How did they make it this shape? Deep fried, I think. Deep fried. This is fried, right? It's fried. 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 Uh, cuisines are、um, much sweeter here, but、um, Shen Yao just said this one originated from Jiangsu Province. But here, the cooking method, the cooking technique, is different from the Jiangsu、uh, Mandarin squirrel Mandarin fish. This one is a little bit sour, not that sweet. I'm looking forward to that. Okay. 而且呢，这道菜其实我们中国人吃菜讲究色香意味形。嗯，那这个呢，就是因为它的形状非常的漂亮，然后叫做松鼠桂鱼。而且桂鱼的桂和富贵的桂是同音，所以这道菜也有富贵有余的意思。哦，有余是有余，有余。那 because 有余 means surplus. Oh, let me just explain. 嗯。色香意味型啊，对，色泽香味儿，然后它的意思寓意，嗯，还有味道以及形状。Yeah, Shen Yao said, you know, in Chinese, because you know, Chinese food is so famous, it has a profound history, and also has a lot of cultural atmosphere, cultural meanings behind it. And we Chinese people, when we、um, describe a dish, we usually talk about it from、uh, 色香意味型 That's the color. Yeah, the aroma,、uh, the meaning behind, and the taste, the flavor, of course,、mm -hmm. and also the shape.、Mm -hmm. For this one, I think it's a perfect example because、mm -hmm. from the color, you can say it's very alluring. It's bright orange, shiny actually, and the aroma here, just sitting in front of it, I'm mouth watering. It smells so good. You can smell the sweetness here from from it, and、uh, the meaning. Actually, it has a really, really good meaning. Ah, we say this "year year have fun" is also, and also "fish fish" is also fish fish's meaning. Because you know, ah,、uh, first fish is fish, 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 So we have to, you know, for、uh, New Year dinners, for family gatherings, the one of the top must have dishes. You should have yu on your table、mm -hmm. because that means you will have surplus in the next year.、Mm -hmm. Wishing, wishing for you know blessings and good fortunes, and especially Mandarin fish is called gui yu. Gui in Chinese means rich and fortune. Fu gui,、uh, same same pronunciation. So this one. Gui yu is the best. I think it's the best choice among all the fish、uh, in the New Year dishes. And then we were talking about se xiang yi, the taste. How about Anna? You describe the taste here. Actually, last year I've been to Jiangsu、uh -huh. in the southern part of China, and I also tried this fish. Yeah. And I think it was a bit sweet. Right.、Mm -hmm. Yeah. This one is also sweet, but not as sweet as、yes. that one from Jiangsu. Yes. And it's a bit sour. Right. Yeah, I like、mm. this better actually. Anna, she last year to Jiangsu, also ate this fish. This fish is too sweet. It has a bit of sweetness for Southerners. Because you know the、uh, the taste of Northern China and Southern China is a little bit different. We are from northern part of China.、Uh, the Southern dishes, I have to say, is a little bit too sweet for me. This、mm. one is just perfect. And the shape we were talking at、uh, at the very beginning, it looks like a squirrel、mm. from the top. So. It's very creation, cre、mm -hmm. cre creative. And I see there are some small balls here,、mm -hmm. like on the top. What are these? This is what? 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 然后还有它的火候也很重要，因为它的肉吃起来很嫩，入口即化，所以呢，它的这个火候需要很好的控制。Yeah. 嗯。
，而且会于它的肉厚，但刺儿比较少，嗯，所以吃起来比较方便。嗯、对 ，it's melon. It's melon. Yeah. 啊、哦，是蜜瓜哦。啊、哦，是瓜。吃下去去啊。I was, I was expecting to be like some small yolta or something. Oh, <laughs> crispy dough. But no, this is melon. I like how it's made from green beans. Because it's also sweet. Yeah, that's very creative. Mm. Very creative to,、uh, you know, mix the fruit the and the fish together.、Mm. Mm, because they're all, you know, sweet and sour together.、Mm. I, I, I really like the, the idea, of the combination. And、uh, Shen Yao was saying that it actually, it's a very challenging, you know, dish to cook because you, we can see from the different slices of the fish here. Every part of it needs to be cut very pre precisely,、uh, and because it needs to be deep fried. But if you fry it too deep, the meat will be really dry.、Oh, okay. The fish is really hard to cook, but this one is just. We take one part, and it's just you know crispy outside and still tender in the middle. Actually, you don't need too much effort, like to take it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. To take it, you just,、uh, you just, you just take it. I don't think、yeah. I need any efforts, you know, to to cut it or to twist it to get it down. Shen Yao, you have to show the audience from this side because we always see it from this side, so you can't see it. It's actually very easy to cut it. Just from this side, so you can see it. It's actually very easy to cut it. Just from this side, so you can see it. It's actually very easy to cut it. Just from this side, so you can see it. It's actually very easy to cut it. 这个真的太好，太考验刀工，就是考验刀工、嗯，而且它的肉得很嫩，不然你做不下来、嗯。对，其实鱼这个东西真的很难做，因为如果不到火候的话，它它其实很难取下来。嗯，如果火火候稍微一过，它这个油炸的嘛，里面就会变得很干，那个水分会流失的特别快。然后这个刚刚好就是外焦里嫩的。Actually, I want to ask about like、mm -hmm. the cutting techniques. Yeah. Do they have like special ones, or can we learn? For example, me, can I learn to do it? Because I'm so curious. I also want to make. Oh my god, you're so brave to learn that. She wants to. Ah, she wants to learn how to cut this knife. She doesn't know 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 how to cut this knife. I want to try you the way how you cook it. Okay. Yeah. 我们可以去请教一下厨师，他可以教你一下。Yeah. So we were、uh, talked. We talked about all six dishes.、Um, actually, we can see there's not only you know it's just not about the fish, the chicken, the beef, and the lamb here. They also they they all have you know some something behind, something behind the dishes itself. There's a history. There's stories behind it. Um, and that's also, I think that's that's very you know special in Xi'an because for 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 fish we were talking about fu gui gui yu nian nian you yu and for chicken that originated from Tang Dynasty. It's just like the city of Xi'an. It's a very historical city. It has a profound tradition here,、uh, cultural atmosphere.、Uh, we were talking about you know in the romantic part, but Xi'an. Was actually the capital of thirteen ancient Chinese dynasties. So you can really feel the vibe of history and traditions here. But I think it has still has a perfect combination of modern and tradition.、Mm, just like you know Han Fu, right? When we were you know strolling around、uh, the city streets of Xi'an, I saw so many people wearing traditional Chinese clothes. That is something.、Uh, I have never seen in other cities. Well, in other cities, there are people, you know, out of their own interest, out of their own choice, they will prefer to, you know, wear traditional clothes. But not that many. Like all tourists, they arrive here in Xi'an, they have to try on the clothes. That's perfect. I think that's that's the charm of Xi'an, the combination of tradition and modern. 就像刚刚我们说这个菜啊，它每个菜背后都是有历史、有故事、有寓意的。的。所以西安这个城市，它本身它就是一种。呃，传统和现代的结合，历史和潮流和时尚相结合，没、嗯、错。就在一座城市当中，你可以感受到历史的厚重，也可以感受到先进的这种科技文化，还有时尚的这种潮流是的素。And Anna, I know you are a fan of the traditional Chinese dress. I think that's very impressive because 
you know, as a Chinese citizen, I can understand, you know, why people choose to wear those costumes. It's very pretty. But as an international student here, why do you choose to wear those dress? Uh, first of all, because I think it's really pretty. Mm -hmm. It's really nice. And also because it became like a trend here in China. Yeah. Like not only the Western style is very popular here, mm -hmm. but also the, like the Chinese one is mm -hmm. also very popular. And you can see not only here in Siena, actually, in many other like Chinese cities, you can see everywhere on the street, like mm -hmm. Like Especially, I think this year, mm -hmm. now last year. Yeah. yeah, yeah, just in recent years. Yeah. So it feels like a new trend in these two years. It was just recent. Everyone was just in the street and choose to wear this traditional dress. But in other cities, I think it doesn't feel like Siena. 这么和谐，没有违和完全没有违和感。对 ，It's just so harmonious to wear those traditional dressings walking on the streets of Xi'an because all the you know buildings they're in the historical way, all the construction, the structures, infrastructure, infrastructures they are just so you can you can feel the history there. 就只有西安这个地方，它能把二者结合的这么好，非常完美。嗯，对。And also, we were talking about the the dishes. It's also a perfect combination of you know, uh, the history and the innovation. 但食物上也是一样，它也是把这个历史从唐玄宗时期的这个鸡，我们现在就有一种创新。是的，嗯。而且，呃，刚刚吃完了这几道菜之后，你们有没有自己口感上最喜欢的一道？哦，或者说整体最喜欢的 ？That's hard. That's hard. Yeah. It's very hard to choose. You go first. <laughs> okay, so I don't remember the Chinese name. Yeah. But I can say, like in English, I like the chicken one. Chicken. Uh -huh. uh, like I like the fish yes. and the lamb. Oh, you choose three. Yeah. Uh, no, how about you, you just, just you, you, you can only choose one. Wow. It's too hard. It's too hard. It's too hard. Yeah, because, uh, but honestly, I was also going for those three. 嗯、um, ，要是我选的话，其实我刚刚想的也是这三个。嗯，呃、uh, ，那还是那个问题，只能选一个吗 ？Okay, that's a difficult question. Yeah, yeah. Xuan Yao told us to only choose one. Um, narrowing down from three, I think I will. Uh, I'm thinking between the fish and the chicken. Yeah, I'll still go with the chicken. I'll go with the fish. Okay, okay. <laughs> because yeah, you know, uh, the fish, although. Jiangsu has a slightly different cooking technique, but I can still try、uh, the Songshu Guiyu, the squirrel Mandarin fish in other places of China. But that pork chicken, I think, I only have tried it here in Xi'an. There's no other places I can find that dish. 那个是只有西安我才能找到的。是的，葫芦鸡只有在西安可以吃到这个做法和口感。Yeah. So its full name is like Chang Chang An Hulu Ji. Chang An is the ancient name of Xi'an,、mm. oh. and Hulu is because of the、uh, the shape. Yeah. And Ji is just chicken, so Chang An Gourd Chicken. 也是黄色的，跟葫芦比较像。Mm -hmm. So this kind of like Chinese dish you cannot find in other places, right? No, no, no. I I've、oh. never seen it in other cities. Um,、okay. yeah, yeah.、Mm. I'm、also、not a hundred percent sure, but just for me, I haven't seen it anywhere else outside Xi'an. OK，、yeah. 其实那道葫芦鸡在不久前举办的中国中亚峰会当中呢， mm -hmm. 也是一道国宴当中的一道菜品、mm -hmm. 啊，所以我们也是把这道菜带给大家，让大家感受一下它的美味。Mm -hmm. You know, a lot of you know leaders from other countries, international leaders, also have tried that when they visit Xi'an. Wow.、Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. How about you? Why do you choose the fish? First of all, because it looks really spectacular. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. And I'm also curious about the, like the cutting.、Mm -hmm. And so I'm, I'm still curious. I want to learn after this. Yeah, I can see your curiosity. Anna, 对这个做法这个刀工太执着了。他说他吃完之后直播之后，他想去找这个厨师学一下。真的想知道他这个怎么把他们切成切成花一样的精细的刀工。安娜平时喜欢做饭吗 ？Yeah, I enjoy. Like, 那你会做中国菜吗？ I can only make dumplings. Oh, <laughs> dumplings! Yeah, that's pretty difficult. Well, that's not that difficult because I can like watch on internet some videos. Mm -hmm. And, mm -hmm. But you know the way、it. you press it into the shape of dumpling, I yeah, think that's yeah, that's pretty challenging. Oh, you're so good. This is how they try. You're so good. Very traditional Chinese food. Yeah, very traditional. That we this Xi'an food, it has so many traditional traditions. 更迭之中有什么创新吗？因为我想它
这个葫芦机它虽然是从唐玄宗年代传承过来，嗯、但是肯定会有变化的。变化是呃，首先这个葫芦机，因为现在很多人来吃完这个美味之后，都想把它带回家。那、嗯、油炸的这个方式其实是不易保存的。嗯、然后葫芦机还有一种做法就是用酱卤的方式。嗯，对，它是用酱卤的方式，这样你就可以方便带走，但口感也是不一样的，也是一种新的吃法。那就法不是这种脆皮的了，是不是？是酱卤的啊。嗯、oh, ，because um for example you know one innovation they make about the gourd chicken is that you know a lot of visitors travelers here they come visit Xi'an they have tasted the gourd chicken. They love it. They want to bring it home, just like me. <laughs> yeah. You know, after today, when we go back to Beijing, I really want some souvenirs for my friends, for my families. I will take that. But that one is really crispy. It's a little bit. It's deep fried, right?、Uh, it's not easy for you know travel for for take. So they innovated.、Um, they made another kind of gourd chicken、uh, sauce sautéed. It's not just、oh. not crispy outside. It's not deep fried.、Um, it tastes different, but still good. Yeah,、so, I want to try that. So this one you cannot like take out.、Um, um, you still can, but I mean it's oil, oily outside. How、okay. do you how are you going to take it back? And also, you know, the skin is very crispy. It's so yeah, yeah.、Uh, it will just break into the crusties. You see, when we plug, you know, one chopsticks in and tear it apart, so I, I don't think it's easy for traveling. 对，就这个其实它，因为它很酥脆，如果带的话，很容易把这个形就散了。是的，口感也会发生变化，就为了让大家能够吃到它从出锅到带回家一样的口感，做好这种预包装的。Yeah, once once you take it home, the the outside is just not won't be as crispy. 嗯 ，Yeah. So now they have this pre-packaging,、uh, pre-packaging gourd chicken still in the same shape but different flavor sautéed one. I kind of want to try that. I will definitely take one with me back to Beijing. 我肯定会带一个回去。那个酱卤的，我刚刚听你讲完哈，我想象不出来它的味道。是还想再尝一下？对，我要带回去。可以带回，因为那个是为了方便大家带走，所以它是做了那种预包装。Yeah， 就是让你回家加热之后，它的口感是一样的。Yeah。So how about you, Anna? So do you have any plans, you know, taking some for your family in Romania? I don't know, but friends maybe in other places of China. Uh, yeah, I think my parents will come this summer. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah. and I, I think I will recommend to them like this kind of dishes.、Oh. 啊，那父母会今年夏天就来看他，他也会带他们来吃这些菜。Oh, 对 ，so I don't need to send them anything， <笑>就不用带走了，<笑>可以让他们来吃更新鲜的。Wow, that's smart. You know, yeah, yeah. Eating here is definitely the best choice. But when you don't have that choice, like me,、yeah. what if you want to taste that in Beijing? Well,、yes. you can call me. <笑> oh, yeah. Thank you so much. That's lovely. Um, will you stay in Xi'an after you graduated? Uh, I think yeah. I think I will stay here. Uh、mm-hmm. huh. Why? Because I, I know you've been to different places in China, and you've only been here for half a year. I think I can get you. I I can get the reasons. It's yeah, yeah it's just such a charming city.、Yeah. But why exactly?、Um, okay. Just staying half a year, and you decide you can you will stay here.、Mm, well, actually, I came to Xi'an before, like two or three times.、Mm-hmm. We had some activities, and I also came here with my friends,、mm-hmm. and I was really fascinated by.、It. Like this rich and long history in Xi'an,、mm-hmm. and since I came to Xi'an, I saw like, like when you first came to this train station, you see a lot of like buildings, like traditional Chinese yeah. style. Yeah, yeah. I'm really fascinated about this, and also the people are really kind.、Mm-hmm. I really、yeah. like the people here. They're very kind and very re- relaxed. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So I think I live a very peaceful life here.、Yeah. It's really nice. And another reason I cannot like forget about this, because、um, here in Xi'an we also have like、uh, a very good university. We、oh, have、yeah. Xi'an Jiaozong University. Oh, that's a、yeah. very I think renowned university here in China、yeah. and maybe abroad as well. Yeah. So I'm really proud of being part of this university、mm-hmm. and students and having so many outstanding people around me.、Mm. So Anna. 他其实，在来上学之前已经来过西安两次了，嗯、跟朋友一起来的来。对，主要是感受到了西安人的这个热情
好客、嗯，然后这个历史的厚重感，还有这个文化氛围，嗯、当然学校也是一个方面嘛。是学校很好，西安交通大学是,是一个非常非常厉害的,的学校。是的，对、嗯、我觉得这个给足了理由。是的 ，And also when you talk about the hospitality,、嗯、I really I can you know echo with that because I only he I'm, I'm I have only been staying in Xi'an for four days so far. 我只来了四天嘛。嗯但是我这些天感受到的，我去坐出租车呀，我去不同的地方，嗯、然后问当地的人，我也是真的感受到这种真诚，这种热情。When I take you know taxis, uh taxis, and I go to different places and ask local people about different variety of questions, I have so many questions here. Uh, they're just so hospitable. Um, for taxi drivers, they will chat with you, talk with you about the history of Xi'an,、mm. their impressions here. They will recommend you where to find the best food, authentic food, and also the cheap one, not not expensive ones. They will warn you, like the food here and the food there, they are the same. You don't go there because that's expensive. That's、yeah. one is where you know local people would choose to buy, and also they will talk to you about you know、uh, their stories in their childhood, how they witness you know Xi'an's changes through the years,、um, from childhood. To grown up,、uh, the changes of the city wall, the changes of the people's you know lifestyle here,、mm-hmm. how Xi'an is transferring from a historical city to embrace the modern as well. 我那天听到一个出租车司机，他跟我讲的就很有意思，因为他是就是土生土长的本地人， mm-hmm. 他就讲他已经就是四十多岁了嘛。Mm-hmm. 他说从小到大，西安变了很多。以前城墙里的西安可能更像一个。呃，比较封闭的、固化的、嗯嗯，这两年呢，也是去拥抱了很多，就是更啊、呃、现代的东西，更高科技的东西,的东西，对，呃，改变了很多。所以我觉得宣扬，你也是算是新西安人嘛，在西安生活了很多年，嗯，很多年、嗯。那你这些年，你看到西安有什么变化？其实刚刚小姐姐说很喜欢汉服，这两年在西安的大街上，你第一反应就是游客变得越来越多了， yeah. 就是大家对于西安的认识啊，还有喜爱都会越来越多，而且这个汉服打卡的人也越来越多了。Mm-hmm. 大街上很多人都穿了这个汉服，而且刚刚我们也说到，汉服是在西安可以说是非常的没有违和感，是的，而且掀起了一股汉服自由吧，嗯、mm-hmm. ，让那些汉服爱好者就像找到家一样，对、yeah. ，会来西安穿汉服，掀起了汉服热。嗯，而且呢，我们西安其实，嗯，汉服文化的发展也离不开有一千两百多家汉服店，这么多，对，哇哦，所以随时随地可以体验到汉服，嗯、然后大家来到西安就会变成一种。旅旅游和打卡的方式吧、嗯，就穿着汉服，感觉就真的回到了大唐，回到了古代，嗯嗯、成为了一个唐朝人。然后在这种沉浸式的氛围当中，去游览西安的大街小巷，西安的这些历史文化的建筑，嗯、还有各个景点，就会给大家带来一种不一样的体验吧。嗯、而且除了这个之外呢，像西安市二零二三年的这个八个方面的重点工作，有一点就是要传承和弘扬我们。中华的优秀传统文化、嗯，所以有很多人都会看到我们西安，其实将传统文化、将历史用不同的方式展现给现在的游客们。嗯、他们看到的是一个创新的、时尚的、年轻的西安。是的，对，不只是有厚重的历史，也有一种新潮的旅游方式。没错，对，结合起来。Yeah.、嗯、so, uh, one thing that Xuan Yao just mentioned is that one of the most Uh, important changes is that Xi'an is welcoming more and more tourists, not from you know、uh, China, but also from abroad, from international city,、uh, different countries here.、Yeah. And also,、um, she also mentioned Hanfu, the tra- traditional dress. It just looks so harmonious walking, you know, in walking in、uh, the Xi'an streets wearing Hanfu. And she mentioned a word that, that I really love the word. 汉服自由，我真的好喜欢这个词。是的,是的 ，It is a freedom to wear 汉服。You don't have to feel, you know, embarrassed to wear to to you know dress something different. Uh, it just looks so normal wearing 汉服 here.、Mm-hmm. It's not it's not just in the、um, tourist travel destinations, uh, but everywhere inside the subway, inside the metro, yeah, uh, buses, restaurants, everywhere in the city, you can wear 汉服 And there are so many people. Uh, wearing Hanfu here, so、mm-hmm. the travel, the tourism industry, the travel economy here in Xi'an is really booming through the years. 嗯，有很多这个文化创新旅游业真的是在蓬勃发展。对，尤其是您刚刚说到的汉服自由，它就体现在
，你之前可能穿着汉服出去，大家可能会觉得有你穿的奇装异服。但现在其实，在西安的话，大家见到穿汉服的人已经是。非常普遍了，是的，就所有人都不会去投去任何异样的眼光，对，所以在这座城市里面穿汉服打卡是我非常非常推荐的一种旅游的方式。Mm-hmm. And actually, you know, wearing Hanfu, walking in, you know, the different historical sites、yeah. such as the city wall. Anna was wearing Hanfu,、uh, yeah. walking on the city wall, and we were at the romantic park. 我们刚才千古情也有很多人穿汉服打卡。Just there, 真的是啊，就是。穿上汉服，你就变成了长安人，变成了唐朝人。Walking through the gate of Chang'an, just like in the Romantic Park, you just become a resident of Chang'an, become、um, a、uh, people from the Tang Dynasty, a travel、uh, back into the history. 嗯，是呢，感受一下这座城市的历史氛围。嗯。那安娜也去了很多不同的地方。她除了、yeah. 除了西安以外 ，you've been to a lot of places like、yeah. Zhengzhou. Zhengzhou is also a、uh, historical city with、mm-hmm. a long history and a rich tradition over there. So,、yeah. what kind of changes do you witness like between Xi'an and Zhengzhou, and also other places, other、mm-hmm. cities in China? Well, yeah, I've been to many other cities like Luoyang, Zhengzhou,、mm-hmm. yeah. and also been to like Dongbei. Ah,、oh, Dongbei. Yeah, also been in the southern part. Uh, like Wuxi, Hangzhou,、uh-huh, Guangzhou. Oh, so that's、yeah. more modern. Yeah, that's more modern. So I experience all kind of like Chinese cities, and I think, uh, like I like the most Xi'an and Luoyang. Hmm.、Mm, Xi'an and Luoyang do like. Yeah. Yeah. Because I think this Hanfu trend is really like popular there. Hmm.、Uh, like both of them, and also Zhengzhou. Like I realized that the like the infrastructure, like、yes. the transport, is really developed there. And、um, there's also a lot of like scenic、uh, spots, like historical places there. So they like combine like the innovation, like the modern with the culture.、Mm-hmm. Yeah, I realize that actually all the cities in China they they started doing this.、Mm-hmm. Yeah. So if you will, you can recommend one thing for the tourists here to Xi'an.、Mm-hmm. One thing. It can be anything. It can be food. It can be science. <laughs> it can be just experience. One thing, a must-try thing for a tourist. What would you recommend? That's also a question for you. <laughs> Because I like Hanfu. I love Hanfu. This is not only my hobby; it's already my lifestyle.、Oh. So I recommend like doing this, wearing Hanfu, going to these historical places, and have a full experience. Like、mm-hmm. I recommend all these places in Xi'an. Like.、Mm-hmm. Um, Uh, City Wall, Tatan Buya Chong, like all these places, even the Terracotta Army, you can、mm-hmm. go there and wear Hanfu and have a like full、uh, experience. Yeah, speaking、mm-hmm. of that,、uh, when I walk on the streets just last night,、mm-hmm. I saw not only young people they were wearing Hanfu,、yeah. 不只是年轻人，我还看到有一些阿姨，有一些甚至奶奶爷爷，全家人，他们也会穿汉服。Yeah, last night when I was、uh, walking along the streets. There is. There was just a lot of families. They're all wearing hanfu. Not、mm-hmm. just young people. There are, you know, people who in their forties, fifties, like,、um, yeah. and and also, you know, grandmas because they're they're they're, they're, they're you know hair is turning gray.、Uh, I think they're probably in their seventies, and also there are male wearing hanfu as well. 很多男士也会一起穿 Yeah, so that's really lovely. Very enjoyable. I like the atmosphere here. I think、yeah. before it used to be like only for young people. Like、mm-hmm. young people would wear this kind of hanfu, but now I think it's like for everyone. Sure. Yeah, it's、mm-hmm. not only for young people. It's it's for everyone. All the Chinese like to、yes. go back、mm-hmm. to their roots.、Yeah. Mm-hmm. How about you, Xuan Yao?、Mm-hmm. As a、uh, I would say local, Xi'an local, 作为一个本地的，算是西安通了。你如果给大家，尤其是我们海外的网友去推荐一项来西安的体验，不管它是美食，还是说景点，还是说文化体验，你会推荐什么？我会推荐美食吧，因为很多人都会喜欢吃嘛。嗯哼。现在吃货非常多，他们去各个地方都先要打卡一些好吃的，然后来到一个地方，先要去感受一下这座地、这座城市它的美味，然后有什么好吃的都去打卡一下。呃。你应该也来西安四天了，你吃过哪些好吃的小吃吗？哦、啊 oh, ，I love 泡馍啊，泡馍
Pong Wu is um, what is Pong Wu? Let, let me think how to translate it into English because we don't have Pong Wu here. Yeah. But I think it's the most famous um, Xi'an cuisine yeah. here here in the city. Pong Wu, I think like, it's sliced uh, pita bread yes. yeah. uh, soaked into the lamb soup. Lamb soup, yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. That's so tasty because, you know, oh, I love that. The pita mm -hmm. bread <laughs> is just like this size, right? And you need to cut it into slices by, yeah. by your hand, by, 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 by your own hand. You just mm -hmm. cut it and while talking to your friend, it, and it's also very <laughs> it's, 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 yeah. it's relieving, you know, the this. The, st the stress here, the pressure, mm -hmm. just the process here. And uh, when the pita bread is completely soaked into the lamb soup, it's just so, so tasty. <laughs> yeah. I can, I can oh. say like in Shanxi dialect, it's like Meidihan. Meidihan. Meidihan, that's a local dialect here in Xi'an. Uh, oh, I also learned one. Really? Uh-huh. Uh, a taxi driver told me that uh, mm. is also how it's very delicious to describe yeah. a food. Yeah. Yeah. 对我们陕西的美食就可以用聊炸类来形容。刚刚我们说到的这个泡馍，然后你应该也有吃那个彪彪面。啊，是的。啊，也也有我们陕西的肉夹馍，还有劲糕等等的小吃都非常的好吃。